Hi guys. Welcome to Lily and Mara or Life with Lily Mara. Today I am answering a few questions that I got regarding the last uh, hair tutorial that I did. Um, so one of the questions was uh, how did you get your hair to grow so long or so quick? Um, I have been natural for, not really natural, but I started my uh, growth process when I got pregnant with my five-year-old. She's five now. When I got pregnant with her, my hair was already natural, so I went... I got a haircut. I, I'm i gonna post a picture right up there so you guys can see the haircut that I got when I was pregnant with her. And from then, I have never used perm or anything like that. I have, uh, I've done a lot of, um, uh, well, not a lot of silk press. I get my hair silk press every now and then, I think twice a year, sometimes once a year. I don't do regular salon visits. I usually treat my hair or take care of my hair at home. Now I've used a lot of products. I don't stick to one product or products. I have used a lot of different products. Um, I've used Soft and Free, the whole line. Um, it's pretty good. I love it. It's pretty good, but when the, the thing about it is some of these products are not available in store. Like if you run out, you can go to the store and grab whatever you're lacking. So with me, I don't keep up or, or I don't pay attention to when a product is running out, I need to order or whatever. So when products like that run out, I would go to the store and purchase, you know, the next best thing. So that is why I don't stick to one product. But with the girls, I have used a lot of different products on them. I remember starting out with, uh, it's, a, it's a set of shampoo and conditioner. I think I got it from Marshall. It was pretty good though. It's, it has, I think it's called coconut milk or it has coconut milk or something or of that nature but if i do find it when i edit this video i'll post it so you guys can see so i used that on my on the girl's hair and it, it's pretty good I, I love it um but i have used a lot of different products on them um right now i'm using sen ives hydrating shampoo and conditioner i think those are available at uh, Target and I think I got the last one I got was from Walmart but other than that if I run out of product products I would go to Target or Marshall I love Marshall products but sometimes you might get this product today and when you come back a month or so they have a whole different line of products so one of the product that I stick with would be the um, olive oil virgin olive oil so when I do my wash and go, I would use it to seal uh, whichever product I, I think I use. Um, Eco Styling Gel, the pink one, on my last video. So I would use the olive oil to seal and those products. Um, to refresh my wash and go, I would use water and olive oil. So I would spray the water all over my hair and then use the olive oil just to give it a little bit of shine or... Um, you know to keep my wash and go looking fresh so to say that i use a particular product to grow my hair i i don't not that i i don't but i don't use i don't stick to one product okay. and guess what there was a lady on tiktok she went viral stating that um she usually used water on her hair no she said she told people that using water on their hair would actually grow their hair and then when i heard that i'm like oh maybe it's one of the reasons why my hair is like this because i have used like when i do my wash and go i would do it for maybe three three weeks the longest 
and I would refresh in the middle or if I need to get um, if I need to retwist it or if I need to twist it I would twist it like big twists and leave it out but I was I would always use water so um, yeah so that's me the girls here are pretty much long as well but I I cannot deal with three heads on a regular basis so my oldest I would get her hair um, I would wash condition and apply whatever I need to apply before she go to the hairdresser to get her braids my youngest the five-year-old she usually have twists with beads at the end so this is how I keep her hair um, longer than usual she would I would keep it for two weeks sometimes three and sometimes for a month but in between, I would always use water and oil. So I'm sharing this with you to let you know it's not that difficult. As, as long as you stick to a product and you keep doing on a regular basis, because I didn't know oil and water grow your hair until I see this, until I saw the lady on TikTok, on Instagram. So with the same with my daughter too, my five-year-old, her hair used to be short, but now her hair, you know, she has good length. The same with my nine-year-old, but you cannot see because her hair always in braids. But I'm going to change that. It's it's a process. Um, but this year, I'm looking to do more videos of how to. Um, it's going to be difficult on me because I cannot style hair. I'm good with washing goes. I'm good with twisting with the beads to the end. And that is me. I don't do crisscross, barrettes, and I can do it, but I've never tried. So I'm not, I'm not a expert, but you know. So this year I'm looking to do more of that um, and to record more videos. But in terms of my hair growth, that is what I do. But if I do find a product that I can stick with, or I'm gonna start where, I'm gonna start using a particular product, but I love soft and free. They have a, uh, a variety of different products you can use for your wash and go. And I, I love the last time I got a refresher, I think it was pretty good. Because instead of using the water, I use the refresher. Um, I think it has, it had rice water or something of that nature so i would use it and i use the oil or i would pour the oil in there and then just spray my hair so i might start use the soften i might start using the soften free again for a long period of time and show you the difference um but other than that yeah that's how i grow my hair so if you have any other questions um you can leave your questions below and i'll do another video but um yeah and for the girls i do use an eyes hydration shampoo that's what we're using right now i think the last one i used was it's a creole one it's very expensive it's a creole one it's pretty good too it has a deep conditioner as well i got that and then i got uh, the shampoo and conditioner and then i got something else it's like a cream that was the last the last one that i used before i switched to sinai so sometimes i wake up i want to do a wash and go oh no shampoo and conditioner so i went to target grab what i can or grab what i used to but target have other variety of other products well-known products like shea moisture um they have a whole line they have other products, but I don't know. I just, I just pick what I can um, and I work with that. So that is me. So this is my third week with my silk press. I got it done for Christmas. I usually got it done for my birthday, birthday week. I think this is my third week because second week and I use some rods 
at the beginning like you guys saw and i'm not a hairstyler i don't and i say oh why she don't do i don't because i just don't i just don't know how to i'm just not interested in doing so i just do what's best for me you know you, you all have to do what's best for yourself you know what's best for you you know at the end of the day it's your time so thank you guys for watching um i will do more videos like this and let you guys see bye bye